There's been a widely discussed debate that's been happening the last couple of months here at Glenthorn. The hub, which is under construction, is going to have four additional classrooms and a new library. But in the recent months, libraries in the country have decreased due to the rise of modern technology, such as the iPad, the Kindle. Do we really need books? Mr Hume, the head teacher at Glenthorne High School, discusses the decline of local libraries. Uh, a lot of libraries are closing down at the moment. Lots of public libraries and lots of schools, I won't name any schools, but I know a school that's less than a mile away from here, that's closed their library. They don't have a library at all. And we're going in the complete opposite direction because we believe that the library is really, really important in the digital age. Uh, and in a library, you don't only get books, do you? you? You get books, you get computers, you get uh, you can search for things, you can you can do all sorts of things in a library. You'll you'll have Skype, so you can talk to authors. You'll have author visits, all sorts of things that should be going on in the library. Everything to develop literacy, which even in the digital age is no less important than it was fifty, a hundred years ago, because literacy and reading remain absolutely a top priority for this school and in learning in throughout your life and what we wanted was to create the library as a very at the very center at the focal point of the school so that everyone that comes into the school one of the first things you see is the library to show the importance of the library to that everything to do with the school. The librarian at Glenthorne provides some details about the importance of libraries. The new library is going to be a center of the school for learning, uh, reading, creating, and um, involvement with authors, creative uh, events. So we're going to have, not only on a basic scale, probably close to a thousand more books, we're going to have a much larger space for uh, events such as author visits, um, open mics where students can become, uh, show off their creativity and their own uh, personal work. So it's going to give us an opportunity to promote uh, all the things that uh, help students fall in love with reading. There's nothing wrong with digital, uh, digital tablets or digital reading, but for me personally, it's about uh, memories really, uh, but great times reading them, discussing them with my friends. While the librarian and the head teacher are clearly in favour for the new library, let's see what the students think. Do books still have a place in schools? Books or e-books? Books. 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 Why? Because I like to actually have it in my hand. E-books are kind of fat. Because you can annotate on them. Because it's physical and you, know, you can hold it and read it whenever really. Both our head teacher Mr. Hume and the librarian Mr. Maxwell are extremely enthusiastic and looking forward to the new build for a bigger, better library. For now, it seems that this library is very much open. BBC School Report, Glenthorne High School.